I'm Harry Cliff, lead curator of the Science Museum's new blockbuster exhibition, The Sun, Living With Our Star. And here are some of my favourite things from the show. These religious artefacts are over 3,000 years old from Bronze Age Denmark, and they represent the way the sun was carried through the sky each day in the Nordic religion. Of all the clocks in the exhibition, this orrery clock is my favourite. The way the gears of the clock are directly connected to this mechanical model of the solar system on top beautifully captures the deep connection between time and the way the Earth moves around the sun. At the start of the 20th century, sunlight was thought to be good for your health. This is one of my favourite objects. It's a light bath invented by John Harvey Kellogg of cereal fame. You'd sit inside it and be blasted with artificial sunlight, and it was supposed to cure diseases from anemia to diabetes. Here I am in an artificial beach that we've created specifically for the exhibition. It's a little moment of playful fun where you can have a break, sit down, relax, and reflect on your relationship with the sun while listening to the sound of beaches from around the world. Since physicists first figured out that the sun shines because of nuclear fusion reactions going on in its core, people have dreamed of harnessing this awesome energy source directly on Earth. This nuclear fusion reactor is part of an ongoing attempt to recreate the sun's energy directly. If we can crack this problem, it will provide unlimited clean energy for all the world's needs. This object is one of the oldest written records of people seeing features on the surface of the sun. It's a clay tablet with cuneiform markings from ancient Babylon, and it says that if you see a white spot on the sun, there will be a famine. This is a real treasure of the exhibition. It's a spectroscope used by the astronomer Norman Lockyer to discover a brand new element in the sun, which he named helium after the Greek god of the sun. It was the first time an element was discovered in space before it was discovered here on Earth. Even though the whole exhibition is about the sun, the sun itself never makes an appearance. But at the very end, you get to meet the sun up close as revealed by the latest NASA imagery. Stunning time-lapse footage of eruptions and flares revealing the awesome dynamic body that is our star.